On a cold April morning, Natra and I left Scotland for Sardinia. I'd only slept two hours, but I'm used to that kind of thing because I'm not very good at sleeping. You could say I'm a part-time bat. Nacho and I play in a band called Bear, and incidentally, he is also a part-time bat. I guess part-time bats enjoy each other's company. We can talk about bat things and whatnot. We were off to the Skepto Film Festival, where a music video we'd made for one of our songs had been selected to screen. Although Nacho forgot his plane ticket for the first part of our journey, we are quite luckily part-time bats and instead we flew to our connecting flight in London. When we got there, we had just enough time for a morning pint before boarding a plane to Cagliari. Bear goes to Sardinia, bear goes to Sardinia, bear goes to Sardinia, the Skepto International Film Festival. Once we landed in Sardinia, the airport confused us and the way to public transportation seemed to be some kind of labyrinth. But eventually we found the train to the city. Where are we? Past, I think. <laughs> <laughs> All back there was the crypto the Should we follow a car? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Somewhat lost, yet happy, we took in the sights, and following a slightly delirious but delicious coffee, we found our accommodation and dropped off our bags. If not, this is going to be funny. Yeah. You know Italian for give me all your gold? <laughs> Very strong people. And, and not very wide. Hello, buddy. Oh, I have a synthesizer in my bedroom. In anticipation for the festival's opening ceremony, we ventured out and ate and drank too much. Guinness. Yep. Oh, yeah. That's what we're here for. An Irish pub. <laughs> All these miles and miles just to find an Irish pub. Is this it? I would say outside. Yes. We made it. We made it. We made it. We, too much we made it. <laughs> well, this is getting better. We got our passes. We're guests. Nacho broke the table. And I broke the table already. E quindi mi piace ricordare la Fondazione Banco di Sardegna che ci ha sostenuto economicamente e per un festival è molto importante. Il patrocinio del presidente che consiglio. Though we don't speak Italian, we very happily sat through some presentations we couldn't understand, but got a good feeling about. There were quite a few vivas to this and that, which we took as a good sign. Um, so, now maybe Goblin, you can tell a little few words about our meeting and maybe something about Requiem, who is this uh, clay motion uh, music video. Yes. Uh, my name is Goblin Mekanen and I'm a filmmaker from Stockholm, Sweden. And um, it's really exciting to be here again. Following some films we really enjoyed. There was a break and everyone moved to the city's large auditorium to watch more. 
spero che vi divertiate, che ve lo, lo possiate godere. Eh, io sono qui in particolar modo. Keen to play some music while we were in town, we then made our way to a local bar. We met some kind individuals in the crowd, and also a fire-breathing lizard who only had one tooth. Evidently, the dragon had plenty of fire to light cigarettes, but no cigarettes themselves. And even though he managed to ask for cigarettes in three different languages, I still don't smoke. When I cried, hey, I Suddenly, before we knew it, it was very late, and we indulged in some much-needed sleep. Not very part-time bat-like of us, but I assure you, necessary at this point. The next day, we decided to explore Cagliari a bit more. The city is beautiful, and as we would find out, a bit mysterious. Suddenly we began to see familiar faces everywhere. You don't see many uh, businessmen on bicycles. No. Like I was uh, yesterday at the uh, Villanova, at the cafe. He's following us. I think so. It's clear that this is all actually a conspiracy if you look at the quality of films by other people. Absolutely, and I think I follow you about not bringing all that stuff. <laughs> I think it's you, Nacho. You're actually a spy. Too much good weather had convinced me that Nacho was indeed engaging in some sort of spy mission. And now, I was out to find answers. Why were we really here? Who had allowed this to happen? What was Nacho's objective? What did it all mean? I see now what's happening. This is another one of your liaisons for your spy activity, isn't it? Yeah. What do you know about Nacho? This is 
Sinatra's informant. Oh, watch out, kitty. He knows too much. After a morning of talking nonsense, we went back to the festival. And spy concerns drifted far away after a few glasses of good Sardinian wine. We found ourselves discussing Godardian minimalism with one of the festival's jury. Let alone that at this moment, I was confusing this with the play Waiting for Gatto, which I have not read. We met up with some more organizers and filmmakers before heading back to the auditorium to watch our music video being played. we found ourselves at a Sardinian tiki bar with a gig. I wasn't quite sure how all this had happened, but there were sparkly lights and good feelings all about, so I let it go. we met up with and made some more new friends, which resulted in staying out until 4 in the morning and playing songs with an elephant, who incidentally was also a filmmaker and had a saxophone for a trunk. Unfortunately, footage of this was somehow lost. From here things ascended into a pleasant rowdy night filled with some sort of local beverage. The next morning, we reflected. It was fun to watch our film with an audience, and to share ideas with people that made things, and to see and hear what they were working on, and to feel excited and inspired about other people's work, and to see them be excited about ours. We'd had a good time playing some music, but most of all we enjoyed making new friends. A few hours later, Skepta was in its third day and really getting into the swing of things. But sadly, we had urgent part-time bat business at home, and so we began our flight back. It still goes to show, if you have the chance, go somewhere new and meet some good people. <laughs>